so a new adventure here at uh, Robbie Travels. I finally feel better after being sick since I arrived here in Manila. On the plane I was puking like four times. I was sick all day yesterday, but finally my adventure can start in the Philippines. I'm so excited and uh, today in a few hours I will take the bus here to Banawe. So that will be the first stop of this trip. Let's go guys. adventure we will go on today so uh, I think this is our bus so uh, funny story actually after I arrived yesterday I met a girl here and uh, now she's my girlfriend <laughs> do you guys believe in love at first sight maybe maybe not but we will see how it goes and here she is. Hi. How are you? I'm good. <laughs> Where are we going to? In Banawe. <laughs> and what will we do there? We're going to tour. <laughs> oh, I think uh, they start boarding. You see it over there. So we should check that one out. Let's yeah, go. Let's go. Here we go. <laughs> So here we have the ticket, like you can see our bus is leaving at 10 p.m. and uh, over here it says it cost 680 pesos yeah. for a 8 or 9 hour drive, how long it was? 9 hours. Was it 9 hours? Okay, for a 9 hour drive. It's a good price to be honest. So now you will sleep, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> I'm ready. And I will, I don't know yet, maybe drink, maybe eat, maybe sleep. Who knows? I know. <laughs> Many hours later. Reservation here Yes, yes, I have. I have. Thank you. So we're here after 11 hours in the bus. <laughs> 11 hours? Yeah, 11 hours. <laughs> the bus arrived usually uh, a little bit uh, late. Because, yeah, uh, there was a lot of traffic there and everything. Uh, they are making a lot of uh, repairs. Uh, yeah. We are but going to Breakers, right? Yes. Breakers. But the weather is great. Come again? But the weather is great. Ah, yes, you are very lucky to visit Banawe. Yeah. Because a few weeks ago when I do trekking, full day raining. So how do you feel, Marita? I feel so At least you could sleep a little. I haven't slept at all. <laughs> Uh, yeah. It's just you're riding in a roller coaster. Yeah. Oh, I'm so tired. I see, I see. I'm tired too, to be honest. But when you come to a place like this, all the green, the nature, the beauty of it, I already feel excited. Yeah, a lot of traffic work. Oh, very long delay. Uh, welcome to the Philippines. <laughs> welcome to the Philippines. <laughs> yeah, there is a lot of road widening here. Yeah, so I know, I know. Instead, we traveled for exact nine hours. We extended with two hours longer. Yeah, they said eight to nine hours, yeah. and it's eleven hours. Yeah. 
you, but you absolutely look at your best today. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so we're here now in the tricycle. Always nice to ride in one of those. register and pay our environment fee it's a 50 pesos which is around one euro they need this to uh, check all the visitors who is uh, entering the municipality of Banawe oh yes and yes I know safety. yes yes okay. And this is the tour map they have there. Yes, sir. Very nice. It's all different tracks. Uh, yes, sir. We have the uh, trekking and day tour activities uh, with this month. The town center. Uh, this is the trekking sites. Yes. Mula uh, Kampulu, overnight in Kampulu. Then the day, the next day, Batat. And uh, they can do the loop all over Batat, and then they can go to Lana. That's for three days. For two days, they can exit here in Sadel and back in Banawe. So for uh, three days trek, you can see Banawe viewpoint, Mula, Patad, and Pangahan. Those are the remote village in Banawe. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, for us, uh, we will start here and then we will stay in the middle. And then late afternoon, we can go to Habao Ranch Terraces, which is the oldest terraces we have in the region. Yeah, that's yes. really nice. That's very nice. And then the day after, uh, we can do the Batat. Yeah, Batat, yes. Batat and Pabaan and Tutligan uh, from the second day to see all those remote villages and UNESCO World Heritage Site in Banawe. The last day, we can do Banawe Viewpoint. Yeah, that's very nice. So, I'm excited to it. Thank you so much, sir. You What's welcome. your name actually? Marvin. Marvin, nice yes. to meet you, man. Nice, nice to, meet to meet you. you. I'm Robbie. <laughs> ah, nice to meet you. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Okay, let's register now. So the registration is done. And uh, now we will go quickly through the hotel to check in. Oh, more traffic. More traffic over there. It's almost as bad as Belgian traffic. <laughs> yeah. And look at the view. That's the viewpoint of that part. That's the uh, place where they shoot uh, the Infinity uh, movie, the Avengers. Oh, oh really? In, last part, yes. in this part, they yes. filmed it. The oh. upper part. Cool. Yes, we're moving again. For 10 meter. <laughs> Even the roads remind me of Belgium. <laughs> okay. So we arrived here at the room now. Oh my god, mosquito attack! Oh, it's good I have my uh, mosquito repellent. Look, it's like a, a beautiful flower on the bed. A flower for you. Hi. <laughs> it's, uh, it's nice. And uh, they don't have air conditioning inside, but it's not so hot either. They have a fan though. Yeah. What is it saying here? Love here, the beauty of the forest, my home. Mm. So let's rest up for one hour and then we will start our day trip here. And this is the view from our balcony here. 
beautiful right within the far there you can see the rice fields what a trip <laughs> yeah it's a long ride it's a very long trip <laughs> but it's quite fulfilling very peaceful yeah so we're gonna have breakfast now and here it says i love banawe with the beautiful view on the rice fields over there <sighs> beautiful what a great start of the day okay guys the breakfast has arrived i have some pancakes with bacon and eggs and uh maridel you have an egg rice and what fried is that rice. in filipino fried rice yeah, and what and tocino what is tocino it is a meat that sweetened meat that sweetened can... meat yeah. okay white smoke i think and sunny side out okay. yeah yeah so let's eat the bacon is good hmm? how is your rice good mm. don't talk with your mouth full <laughs> <laughs> i did the same so <laughs> yeah. mm, the pancakes are really good as well So delicious. Mm. <laughs> why are you always laughing with me? What's wrong? <laughs> why, why is your hat in your plate? <laughs> I don't know what's happening here, guys. I don't. I absolutely have no idea. But what I know is that it's the most amazing view to have breakfast. Yeah. What are you doing there, slaughtering a pig? No. Did you hear that? It was like a pig getting slaughtered. Ah, no. <laughs> yeah. Or it's you in the evening. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm joking. So we're ready to go, guys. Yes. Yeah, my limousine for today. <laughs> the tricycle. So where will you take us? Uh, we are going sir, to Hapao Rice Terraces, which is uh, one of the listed uh, UNESCO World Heritage Site in our place, Banawe, Fugao. Okay, thank you. Okay, Let's okay. go! So we're now on our way to the Hapao Rice Terraces. It's a one hour drive from our hotel. So we will enjoy this uh, tricycle right now. Oh, slides. It happens often that there are slides here because I saw the warning sign. Ah, yes, sir. Especially when it's uh, rainy season. Yeah. Uh, we have a lot of uh, landslide. Flood, we don't have flood. Landslide only. Oh, okay, okay. So if you get here in the rain season, it can be quite dangerous. Stable. Yeah, the soil on top is not stable and when it's raining it can come down on the roads down here. So you need to pay attention then because it would be your last trip if you get stuck in something like that. Can you believe this guys? These rice fields are more than 2000 years old. Can you imagine this? So beautiful. Uh, we are entering the municipality of Fungduan. Municipality of Fungduan is the one uh, is one of the last stand of Tomoyoki Yamashita uh, way back uh, World War II. Oh. They captured Yamashita and then bring him to Baguio and then they declare Philippines as independent uh, country after that oh. one. Yes, and Hapao has the biggest and widest terraces in the region, which is also included as one of the UNESCO World Heritage Site. It's a very very beautiful view here, right? So if you cross that bridge over there, uh, we are it's that bridge over there. That's the boundary of Banawe and oh, municipality okay. of Honduan. Okay. Yep. Wow, what a view. Uh. 
over here we have a method that uh, we adapt from the ancient times to help each other for example uh, you guys uh, your terraces is to be harvested tomorrow as a friend as a neighbor i will come without something uh, and then you will come help and then yes. you you return the favor when their land is needs to be yes. yeah yeah oh, yes yeah it's so nice it's we so do nice. that all over uh, and how Kingdom. how do they take it then it's like a, a big bag of 70 kilo they put on their back and then they or, or how they do it we have a wood uh, in this size maybe longer we put the rice uh, in in both sides and yeah. we will stay in the middle oh and so the we can rotate if oh we are yeah tired. like that oh yeah i saw it yeah so uh, when we are on the trail sometimes there's a tree so we need to revise the position yes yes so otherwise back, yeah yes. But 70 kilo, that's a lot, eh? if you need to come all the way from down there, all the way up here. Ah, yes. Yeah. When we start to work, no one speak. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But when it's harvest time, every locals are making the natural uh, rice wines, which is served to the people who works on the terraces. Yeah. So we have two divisions of work in the village. For planting season, women will be the one to plant the rice cleaning the stone wall and then they will be the one to harvest yes in planting day men will be the one to cook the food for the women who is planting uh, our own place or property so harvest season men will be the one to cook and also at the same time to carry or to howl yeah all, those, all uh, the rice. rice yes in preparation the terrace for the terraces the women will be the one to make the seed beds to where we can put the grains and uh, later on it will become the baby rice to be planted and then men will be the one to check the damage of the terraces to check the water source for the terraces yeah, yeah. so when the harvest comes uh, how long does it take to clear a field like that and with how many people they work at one field then in this size yeah in this size for example you need at least uh, more than 10 people 10 people and how long it will take uh, because it's all manual so it will take quite some time i guess oh yes let's say two days average two days yes, yes. yeah so over here that's what we do like uh, when someone is uh, harvesting we go and help it's so impressive you know mm -hmm. it's already hard to do this job with machines so oh, yeah. just imagine how hard it is to do it all by hand Man, yeah it's it's hard over my, here, my biggest respect to you people really really thank you very much <laughs> Even the job is very hard, but uh, when you help each other, it's going to be easy. Yeah, yeah. That you see still a lot in the Philippines, yeah? people helping each other. Oh, yes. Like for example, in Europe, it's not that much anymore. It's more everybody on themselves in Europe. But here you see that people come together and they, they work together and help each other. Oh, yes. So that's really nice to see, yeah. <laughs> and uh, I'm very glad to say that in our uh, country, uh, we do that way. Because you will never know what will happen tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Our culture is more preserved. How many rice terraces are here? Five? In the area of Banawe? Uh, a lot. Banawe have 19 villages and each of them have their uh, own. Oh, okay. Because they always talk about the same five, but they're actually way more. No. Uh, yeah. It's way more. In, yeah. in books, in travel blogs, they are on, only mentioning those certain points. Bata, yeah. Banawi viewpoint, Bangaan, Dukli, Ganhapao is five. Yeah, it's five, yes. But originally, uh, it's a lot. Yes. Those are only published places. Yeah. Which is written on the book. But if you explore Banawi, you can see uh, more than, let's say, 20 or 30. Oh my God. Yes. <laughs> Impressive. Yeah. So you see it? A lot to explore here in Banawe. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> so now we're gonna start our hike to the Hapayo terraces. Uh, it's gonna be, I don't know if it's gonna be a hard walk, but it uh, looks quite steep. So we will see. Are you an athlete? What is wrong with you? <laughs> the view really is fabulous, you know. Pure Tagalog. 
So Tonton Victor here will guide us into this hike. He does this hike for more than 45 years already. So he's a very experienced guy here. And we see he even carries a machete there. Yeah. Used for uh... coconut, cutting trees, coconut. I know. No? <laughs> because I'm so, I'm also a pagan priest. Oh, you're so a priest someone, as well. Someone called me to pray. Oh, okay. Machete for uh, butchering. Ah, it's for uh, sacrificing yeah. and doing some rituals, okay. I can do some rituals. Oh, so we not only have an excellent guide with us, but also a priest. And it's uh, very hot here. <laughs> Look at my face. <laughs> so this trail is from the Spanish colonization, right? And uh, it's from 1521. And it goes all around the rice terraces. So... Yeah. <sighs> <laughs> Happened to a Spanish guest. I asked them, you pay your debt to my grandfather who built the Spanish trail. Yeah. Because they are not being they are not paid by the Spaniards during that time. No, they probably were like treated like slaves yeah. and they had to build this for the Spanish. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But Philippines has a very a large history of uh, colonization and everything. The British, did they also rule a little no. bit over the Philippines? No? no. no. Only Spanish. Oh. And Japanese. Ah, and Japanese, yeah, during the World War. That's why uh, people here, they like white, uh, white, white. White people. When they see you, they say, ah, Americano. They yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> American. Yes, yes. And they like them, they help them. Yeah. But if Japanese come, if they don't like them. <laughs> it's possible they will stun them. A lot of Japanese come here? Yeah. Careful, Careful huh? <laughs> Did ever somebody fall? Yes. You had? Yeah? Yes. And I hope they fall to the left side then and not to the right. Sometimes inside. Yeah, okay, luckily. And uh, sometimes outside. Oh, outside too! <laughs> uh, okay, good luck. <laughs> So this is how they fertilize it. Yes. And it's sunflower. And the water will uh, spread the uh, nutrients of the sunflower. Oh. For the plants, for the rice. Oh, and it looks so beautifully green everywhere. Yes. So when do you think this will be harvested? Uh, July. July? July? Yes. July? Okay. Wow, amazing. <laughs> Look at this. Ooh. The French people, when we come here, they say, ah, son solice. <laughs> <laughs> they sing that when they come here? So, oh, Champs Elysees, oh, Champs Elysees. Oh, look, this is a message for you, love. <laughs> oh, yeah, <I> <laughs> so, this they planted three weeks ago. Here you can see the oldest walls, more than 2,000 years old. This concrete just started in 1980s. And the concrete is from the, the 1980s? The oh, okay. And before that it was just all mud here, I guess. 
Yeah. Yeah. Refreshing water. <laughs> Is it cold? Sitting next to each other in the ice cold water. <laughs> oh. it's, a, it's a form of workout. You know, yeah, that, actually, that. actually, they do it a lot. That eh? after workout, go into an ice bath. <laughs> <laughs> I always like to fool her. <laughs> yeah. How could you lay here in the cold? It's so cold. It's freaking cold. <laughs> <laughs> it's too cold for me. I'm a pussy. <laughs> no, I will try. Oh, oh my god. Oh. 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 It's so cold. So cold. Oh, so cold. Body character. Embrace the wind of the water. Yeah, embrace. Yeah. Embrace. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so fat that I'm gonna start floating away. <laughs> it's like having a rescue vest. And uh, then after that, we will go in the hot, hot spring. spring. Yeah. yeah. So that our, our skins and muscles will be relaxed. Fuck! It's too funny. No, no, great. <laughs> I thought there was a crazy fish jumping on me. No. <laughs> because they told there's snakes here. <laughs> the guy said it. Huh? But not here, he said up of the mountain, but uh <laughs> It was a bug that attacked us. It's very nice. Yeah, but my legs getting down. Why you have so many cramps? I don't know. Because when I keep playing badminton. Yeah. You're supposed to be an athlete. Now you're just an old woman. <laughs> when you go in the same way, I think you will carry me back on. <laughs> you have so much pain? Yeah. You, you remember what I said to you before? You were always laughing to me that why oh, you have terrible conditioning. Uh, <laughs> and in the end, I, what I told you, I think you might be surprised. <laughs> I'm older. I have, a, I have a lot of pain in my legs. Yeah, but you're not older than me. Yeah. I'm 35. Yeah, I'm 16. Yes, I do. 16? Oh, that, that, that's not correct. She's uh, 29, by the way. <laughs> Do I look 29, guys? No. She looks older, right? <laughs> oh, always having cramps. <laughs> Bye! A hippo. <laughs> hippo. So that was very nice guys. The hot water spring and then the cold water from the river. Ooh, so nice. Now we still have a short walk on our way to our tricycle again.
This is amazing guys. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. Yeah, honestly, the beauty of this place here, it can be captured on camera. It's amazing. I cannot walk because it's too dangerous to walk and talk in the same time. But uh, wow, what a place. Amazing. That's all I have to say. Hello. 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 <laughs> Hello. 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 How are you? Are you doing good? Yeah. <laughs> bye bye. Oh, bye bye. <laughs> so sweet, those kids. Yeah. Awesome. Look at this with the water on the rice fields, the reflection in it. Wow, beautiful place, beautiful. Oh no, <laughs> are we gonna cross that bridge? <laughs> no. no, apparently not. <laughs> we are going straight, not the bridge. <laughs> So this is the hammock where uh, Tonton Victor sleeps. Yeah. Thank you, uh, Tonton Victor, for uh, inviting us in our in your home. You all build it yourself. Yes. Yeah. The place is local. I have no money to build. Yeah. It's very nice. Hello, inside my house. Yeah, I will look. I will look. I will follow you. Thank you. So you have uh, small chickens? No power. No power. No power. It happens a lot here that you have no power. Yeah. Yeah. They are uh, doing uh, something on the line. Yeah, they're working. Even in our hotel today, they don't have power. So, it's what you do free. here? You, when friends here, come, please. when yeah. friends come, you go sit here. Yeah, okay. Stay here. Oh yeah, that's nice. It's nice. I would uh, like to see inside, but it's way too dark. I cannot. Unfortunately, I cannot uh, show it, <laughs> but uh, from what I can see, it looks really nice. Yeah. And here you cook or? Oh, yes. Yeah. I my kitchen, my dirty kitchen, the black kitchen. Yeah, yeah, I saw it. Where was the, the plate? Yeah. There you cook. And what do you do with the small chickens? I small we let them grow. We feed them. You feed them? Yeah. And then? When they grow up. You eat them. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I show you the rice. Yeah, yeah, it's ah, good. Show me, rice. show me. Oh, really? Nice. Yeah. And what do you do with that then? You pound it here. You pound it there with the stick, I guess. Yeah, yeah, with the stick. Yeah, so. And then this all comes loose, and then yes. yeah. It's, uh, red rice. Red rice. And what's the difference between red and white? It's more delicious. It's more delicious red rice. Yes. Oh, okay, okay, okay. More vitamin. I have to ah. try. <laughs> yeah, I never tried red rice before. Oh, you have another chicken there, a black yes. one. One. Yeah. It's the only big one you have? 
Oh, I have 10 like that. Ah, okay. okay. Good for food. But I free them early morning, you see one is there. Oh, oh yeah, now I see them. Yeah, they come from uh, behind the, the house. <laughs> Father, the mother. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for showing Hopefully me everything. You like the place. Yeah, I like it. I like it. It's yeah, really nice. You, yeah, yeah. Maybe one day when you become young, you come again. I will do. I will do. I promise. One day I will come again. You're tired, eh? Yeah. She's always laughing with me that I have terrible conditioning. Oh. And I said her I will show you wrong. And and now she, she's here complaining. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Look but, at uh, this. Good. Just an exercise yeah it's because good exercise warm up because uh, tomorrow you tomorrow it's a long tomorrow. hike eh? so get some rest eh? it was very nice to meet you thank you so much you can uh, go because otherwise it will rain yeah it's, i already felt some drops coming from the sky so but soon it will hard, you know, yeah but when it starts you know make it you pours sick. <laughs> make you sick yeah yeah, we oh, go, we go. Smile. We go. Oh. What's your hand? Yeah, this will be the end of our first day here in Banawe. So I hope you guys liked it. And uh, i see you again next time. Take care. Cheers. Bye-bye.